are back, moving into our second conversation for this morning, Paul. Tell us what we're doing. Yes, so we have none other than the man himself, Joel Dara Robinson, Robinson. the founder of Dara Fun Razor. Good, Good morning, morning, sir. Blessed uh, morning. Blessed morning. We refer to you as Mr. Dara, right? Because that's what most people oh, know, you know you as. Yeah. But your first name is really Joel. Right, <laughs> but right, most right. people don't know that. If, if, if you said Joel, then I know who no, that is. Yeah, they, they say Mr. Joel. Who, who that? Yeah. Sir Dara. Oh, we know who they are. school mate, they know me as that. As you know? Joel. Joel. Yeah, yeah but this is Mr. Dara. Well, uh, Mr. Joel Dara. Robinson, mm -hmm. called by a full government full name. Government. Um, let's first of all talk about uh, the year Foundation. and how the year has been for you. I understand mm -hmm. you were you you had been recognized uh, this yeah, year as well. Yeah. Um, well, once I got health and strength mm -hmm. for me, the year uh, great, mm -hmm. reg reg regardless of the lead struggle and the lead things where we got you in our life you know as long as i got health and strength i feel blessed and always thankful you know so i don't make everything bother me like that you know yeah. once i have health and strength i work with life like that and try to work with it you know? and really really you're, you're true in saying that because health and strength and life yeah, that really what you need yeah, to get up I uh, keep and going. Do, do whatever you need for Do you need that? You understand? You can't do nothing lying in a bed or they don't sick, you know, because everything stopped there, you know? So that, and and yeah, it's so. that health and strength that you have that have given you the opportunity to continue press on mm -hmm. with your program. First of all, let's, for those who may not be fully familiar mm -hmm. with what you do with the program, Let's talk a bit about that. Give us some insight to what you well, do. Well, um, people know me as a food man, you know. I um, look out for people. I mostly fight hunger. I I have somebody where not like just talk hunger. And I not deal with hunger with big man or woman. I deal with kids, you understand? Mm -hmm. And um, it's been a journey. It's been slow sometimes, you know, you do it. You, you, you stop in between, you try to do it, you try to continue. But basically my message that um, we do have kids going to school and from the primary school up to college and thing and on. I try to use my life and my own life story to bring our message towards that, that hunger there. And we have to try to do what we could do. I do my lead part. See, mm -hmm. we ask everybody who could contribute and could do, help with it, help with it, you know. Mm -hmm. So tell me, tell me, uh, Mr. Dara, where, where did this passion come from? Wait uh, yes, for, for yes, fight say, hunger, like you said. Listen, um, the, my life story, you know, mm -hmm. I, I was a victim of the very same thing I did try to fight for, mm -hmm. you understand? So I know what it did to me education-wise and the trauma it had and um, you, you know it, it could make you an angry person it could it could make you do crime it could make you um grow up to be somebody different you understand? Mm -hmm. of course because um, i always describe it like this you know when you hungry you know the first thing one start deal it to your belly your belly Why? and at the, you know and then you reach out to try get food and the rejection there for your own family for people right away headache and come that the next, that the next step we do after headache and your belly the anger you're going into so you might end up for yourself they try to do something you understand and, and no excuse for, for say like hurt people or rob and things but that was serious thing man you understand i like i like how you explain it because you start from your belly yeah man. and then it moves a to bad feeling and, and a bad feeling what Trust cut me. it what cut it that the availability of food the availability yeah of and, and i find out over the years um when when the program was in a big glory i find out Kids want to go to school just because they know like um, food that there. food one mm -hmm. there, you understand? And, um, so it's very important. It's such a question why 
parents sending kids, you know, but we, sometimes we could be out there and the judge, we don't know where they happen home. And a lot of times that single mothers and um, basically have four or five mouth feet, they have a deal, try to see how they compare their own utilities and the cost of life and everything. So it do happen. I, I, I don't have this boy and we've been down the road and struggled, you know, and I just use So that. Your, your fundraiser, and this is just to, for, to clarify for the folks at home, this is not just a, a one, two, three um, time for the year event. Dara's fundraiser is every single day of yeah, the year. Yeah, and I never had planned to do anything this December, mm -hmm. you know, because we just come out from a major hurricane that Christmas time. Mm -hmm. But I I basically do this dance and all white tribute to Otis because my farm may get badly damaged. Mm -hmm. And um, the farm we use to get food. I mean, I have ducks, turkey, chicken, sheep, rabbit, you name it up there where normally around Christmas time and then I have a lot of ducks and mm -hmm. things. You know, because we do sell to half of the farm we do. Yeah. But we take one major hit, Lisa, that wasn't a nice girl, you know. <laughs> you mash up my farm and there like three years I was doing it and uh, basically most of the trees were gone down, broke up the run and trees that stop at the, um, the layers cob wow. and the sheep pen. I mean, and the era I did, I want protective era where wildlife roam. So mm -hmm. basically, the animal and leopard and one out there. So, they, 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 they left. Yeah, yeah, that, the, the no, cages. they're not left. They're staying at the era. Okay. But you have a lot of predators, but they included tiger. Uh -huh. and, but thank God so far, we still got with dog and a few bodies. So some of the ducks then start to come back and thing because I guess after they had breeze and rain. Most of the animals they scatter themselves, yeah. you know. Wow. But, so, yeah. but basically, um, this fundraising, I have to try. While people maybe they home they celebrate for Christmas, I went in at the bush to try clean my place and try get back that pan truck. You understand? So, so tell us a bit about the event then. The tribute white to affair. Otis well, Redding. Listen, most people know me for reggae. Yes. yes. And I have a mad following for that. I could have did a reggae show. I said, listen yeah, to yeah. me. This a this a Ali calm time people into love and boom boom and I sit down and I come up with the idea. Why not do an Otis Redding mm -hmm. tribute? No, that far out of my <laughs> league because we the top Otis. Um, 26 year old young man you know, crashed the bar case, 1967. Sad story, but you want to know how a young boy like that sings so much song with pain, you understand? Mm -hmm. Listen to your music and get it. I grew up on that music. Maybe that's why I grew up humble because of the, the type music and thing where I made the wrong. I put it out there, get a few Belizean artists and things to part of the show, you know, they bring in Metro with an organ and like that. And people really they react to it. I mean, I get call where people want purchase tickets, they want book tables in advance. I mean, they really, and I never expect it may be like that, you understand? But I guess people don't know the Ara Cyber deal with clean entertainment and we you know push nothing out the way vulgar Negative. and out of other but you say uh, uh belize ex-servicemen's league yeah i need for those queries or because um then they tried the ex-service belize ex-service league mm -hmm. whether they try though that try to take out just some men but okay. we grew up like that so because they all service league. because they also explain that woman serve to you understand mm -hmm. but even hard for me like when i talk i still want to say belize ex service men because, because that's how you that bled yeah. me now we understand mm -hmm. but yeah. that belize ex service league you know okay. but um the event that's the venue basically with the charge and small fee at ten dollars we come in and you're the kind of entertainment you want to get for that um Dollars $10 only. Uh, you I have galas where they go for a <laughs> hundred and seventy, sir. Yeah. Ten dollars. We just come off a hurricane. Yeah. Um. Basically, people still get back off of this COVID. Mm -hmm. I want to put this out there to like 
feliz safety you know you could come out still bring your mask if you're the dancing somebody strange if you feel comfortable wearing a mask wearing it if mm. you're there your own partner i guess you know have yeah, to worry on a board sleep together so <laughs> yeah. you understand but um i'm telling you the show a lot of elders they meet me and can't wait for yeah. it and that has um, been the response right and i, I know the uh, one thing i know possible my thing but i feel the vibes when i'm out so yeah, this is going around. to help you to rebuild back your farm well that's the this plan is, yes like i said i know really want yes i want my christmas then i may mm. big christmas cake mm. come along and eat but basically my job for this christmas is that on my farm and get it back and the workers that I will provide food, vegetable and things. If, Plus if, are income if there's somebody wants to donate to you, right. how can they do um, that? Apart from this fundraiser. Like a, like um I want to give me number, then mm -hmm. it start fun because, like I said, I have an account too, but I, I an income to pay off with it. If you give us I the have, number, we can. We can. Um, my number is 623 3662. 623 3662. I always answer my phone unless like a de panchal if I ever got it for me. <laughs> but um I also want to quick um, mention what else entertainment uh -huh. we have. We have this guy Metro, you know, Emmet Osha, mm -hmm. he like a one man band. The mm -hmm. legend could play anything. Wow. He and he'll give you the artist. You know the old school reggae. Ah, uh, he could sing, uh, singing. Yeah, great guy, man. If wow. if it was planned better, probably yeah, me and try it. bring yeah. her, make we do one thing. But um, beside that, I said, listen, when you do old school and then kind of thing, people into broke down music. Uh -huh. I say I want to bring. I could have played Doggy King, song and coconut, but I said. Isn't it better for them to and do a leap performance? Uh -huh. It'll be a whole show, but then guys and pass through both Doggy King uh -huh. and Coconut Boy and can do a lead thing. Uh -huh. I got for Kenny Morgan because he known for yep. play the baddest of all days. Yep. Yes. I get Tony G for finish like when Morgan take a break for come in. We have two sessions where we we'll be like for the five minutes on over where you want to soul to strictly Otis wedding mm. music because mm. I want the thing. The nice so waltz wrong. kind of w slow yeah, dancing. Man, real. And it's, I need to also explain it's an all white. It's never uh, like. We're white. You see the color you in now, dress nice. If you come like that, they're like, you can't enter. No, mm. you could come you could in. You still come in. Right, as long as you pay your yeah. money, it's just. Well, he dress code. I mean, yeah. why the thing look uniform? Of but course, of course. But if that is the instruction, I also Sadara, need wear to white. explain that people like, tell me. But why you say bring out the entire family? That's a leave mistake. I gonna put in at the yeah. end. <laughs> now adult affair. Adult right. Affair. right. Affair. So we they try. Well, they try say people yeah. say people and want bring their picnic. We know. Mm. I love kids, of course. Of course. I know, but, um, it's not the it's setting not for, for this. It's not for kids. Okay, if you're the soul, you know, want to pick me. Yeah, <laughs> <I'm hungry. laughs> yeah. no so so this is for you and your no partner kids, to call. No kids allow because yeah. it's an adult and a clean. Not because I said I want to show Yeah, yeah, me. yeah. Anything. I already ask you to come out with good behavior. Yeah. You know, because, not because of mature people mean you know when people get under the lead <laughs> thing that they start thing and come out behave on yourself and also i want to provide showing what is live on the, you can use the projector mm -hmm. on a huge screen so they can mm -hmm. get say the great what is in action mm -hmm. but i have it planning on my head i just put it together with the grace of god yes. and the support of the people the that so this event the actually tomorrow no saturday saturday, saturday, saturday night so you got two more days but all this entertainment for just ten dollars and then we start the actual show start eight we're going till three but um for six o'clock if you early want to come out my drinks are cool you could come and take out a few corn. Of course, when you're walking, the first music you want to hear that over this. So if you yeah. feel like you really can squeeze, can you be a night of squeezing? Trust me. Yeah. Nice. Nah, it's not, it's not yeah, just squeeze the bottle at home. <laughs> 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 All right, well. But um, I, just before yeah, I left, man, I'll forgive you. Your, your I'll forgive. sponsors. I, of course, I need to big up my sponsors because without these people, the show won't Would be. be and I also have people behind the scene when I really want to big up and they yeah. do try yeah. help me. But 
everybody where they upon this that the, the sponsor will help with this event and date me through the years we are start off with creme tv creme radio angelo express limited travelers liquors vibes media and television bellykin we have bellykin product of course nice, out there uh, everything we have radio we have tv channel seven we have Belize Pro Progressive Party, of course, Channel 5. No thanks to the sponsoring. Rajo's Store, Honorable Anthony Mala, Madisco Limited. We have the Office and the Prime Minister and Social Security Board. Thank you guys for making this event possible that I could do it. Of course, we ask the people to come out. If you could dress in your full white dress, if the half fight white, I just want the place yeah. look uniform and things. If you if white you and your clothes black. <laughs> if yeah. you have a vision, Mr. Darrow, we hope that people will yeah. take out their yeah. white clothes and come yeah, to man. this well, Otis okay. Reading as all white. You heard it here. Dara Cyber Home Theater presents tribute to Otis Redding Red and to Otis. all white affair. And dance. dance, and you heard it from the man himself, a night of squeezing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so we want to thank you, Mr. Darrow, for coming in and telling us all about, about this event. Yeah. All the best with your fundraiser, all the best yeah. with your farm. And, uh, I, and I will um, invite the media, mm -hmm. like who is out there already, to, to see the update for me. I keep everybody okay. posted. Okay, so good, sure we know, good. Okay perfect and of course if you want to donate outside of this fundraiser you can always contact mr dara at his number i think we had it up on the screen 623 3662 623 3662 beautiful beautiful so much for coming in mr dara Thanks. best of luck to you i will keep talking more about community engagement and how you can be a part of the fundraising events in our next conversation we'll be right back with our next break Stay tuned. Watching the ships roll in, and then I watch them roll away again. Yeah, I'm sitting on the dock of the bay, watching the tide roll away. Ooh, I'm just sitting on the dock of the bay, waste the time. 